Jonathan Ashworth revealed Tory MPs want to get rid of Boris Johnson as he and the government should focus on the current cost of living tsunami rather than his political survival. Shadow Work and Pensions Secretary Jonathan Ashworth shared concerns over the government's inaction regarding the ongoing cost of living crisis. He claimed Tory MPs are in a state and said they need to show some backbone if they want to get rid of this guy. Referring to the government, he claimed they are more preoccupied with Boris Johnson's political survival rather than the financial survival of people across the country. Mr Ashworth said, the Prime Minister and the Cabinet should be focusing on the cost of living, but they are not because of this ongoing target. This will continue with Boris Johnson, there will be something else down the road. Tory MPs know that. When you speak to them privately they know that. Just none of them know how to get rid of him, even though they want to. When speaking privately, they say they are in a state. They need to get rid of this guy. But if they want to get rid of this guy, they need to show some backbone. Have a no confidence vote. He also added, the thing for me is that Boris Johnson and the government should be focused on the rising cost of living, this cost of living tsunami. But instead the government are preoccupied with Boris Johnson's political survival. They are paralyzed by inaction. The Conservative Party are completely divided and Boris Johnson focuses on his political survival, not the financial survival of people across the country. So all of this just completely distracts the government from what they are supposed to be doing. And I think at the end it is why Conservative MPs should act in the national interest and get rid of him and give us a new Prime Minister, because we need a government focused on the cost of living crisis. Not the drama of Boris Johnson. The Prime Minister and the Metropolitan Police are now facing fresh questions after some photos picturing Mr Johnson toasting colleagues while standing next to a table laden with wine bottles, glasses and food have been released on Monday by ITV News. The pictures are believed to have been taken at a leaving due at number 10 for the Prime Minister's communications chiefly came on 13 November 2020.